Hello everyone today, I've got a quick tutorial for you here on how to create a legit functioning iTunes account to make playlists and store your music etc without having to put any credit card details in at all. So let's begin. Firstly obviously you want to open up iTunes, there it is, give it a second it should pop up. Ok so there we are, so as you can see I'm not signed in and if you wanted to to store your music or anything you need an account so to make your account you just want to go to App Store you need to go to the App Store to create it and what you want to do is you want to find any app available that's free it doesn't matter what app it could be anything at all just find one that's free so let's try this so as you can see this is 119 so that's not what we want so let's go back to the App Store and find a free one like this one for the Oscars there we go free app so now that we've found a free app, uh, it's going to click free and obviously it asks you to sign in. Um, to obviously create a new account, you just want to create a new account there. And the first few pages will be the same as a usual, create, creating a usual account any other way. Like this page, you want to accept that. Make sure you accept the terms and conditions. Continue. Enter in your information like you at domain oh, domain.com enter in some password uh, a sensible question for recovery uh, your date of birth whatever that may be and your newsletters there you go uh, so you can decide if you want those or not. Continue. Okay, obviously I've just been making these up, so we need to change this. Uh, emailplace.com, and we just go make a longer password. So obviously you want to put in your real information here. I'm just making things up for the purpose of this tutorial. So as you can see, this is where the credit card details come in. This is the important bit. So usually, if you create an account, usually uh, you'd, th th there would not be this option here of none. You'd have to select one of these and insert your details. But as we are buying a free app, we don't need to put in any of this information. So we just click none. Give it a second to load, and we can now bypass all of this information here. Just click none and move on means we don't have to put in any credit card information. Do you want to insert your correct address here? Whatever you, whatever this may be, it could be. Uh, I'm just creating things up here. Um, anything really? Whatever that may be. So insert your real information, make sure you've got none selected there, and continue. And as you can see now, uh, an email has been sent to the address below with a link to verify your account. Make sure you check your email and follow the link to complete your account setup. So obviously this will be your email here, and go to your email, click the link, sign in, and you're done. You now have a functioning iTunes account with no credit card information needed. Done. And there you go. So if I just sign in with mine, uh, you can see I sign in here. And just to show you that I don't have any credit card information on mine, if I just try and buy this album, buy, verify my password, usually it would just begin downloading, but it asks me for credit card information as you can see. And it asks me for credit card information here because I haven't put any in already. So obviously you can't buy anything with this, with these accounts, unless you 
do put in critical information. Um, but just for story music and things, my account, my music, it's all there. So there you go. I hope this helped. Um, and it goes to good use. Thank you. Uh, please subscribe.